Hello and welcome back to the Manchester United Master League. So we start off this with a view at the Premier League standings. As we see we have won three games, drew two with no losses. The same as Tottenham Hotspurs. Same amount of goals for as well, what's the chances? So we are now taking on Huddersfield Town who are in 13th position. They have 6 points from 5 games. I mean they've won 2, lost 3. Not drawn any, so hopefully we can uh, we can beat them because at the bottom of the table so far we've got Cardiff, Brighton and Bournemouth, Everton struggling down there. You'd be expecting them to do, be doing better than that in 17th. Not very really good. So where's Liverpool? Liverpool are in eighth. Arsenal are in fifth. Chelsea in fourth. Man City in third. Tottenham in joint first with Manchester United. So we need to get this win over Huddersfield. Can Manchester United do it? Do they have what it takes? Can Lukaku keep up the form? Let's find out. In this game against Huddersfield. Let's get into it. Day for you. So we here we are at home the the welcoming Huddersfield Town. Can Manchester United get the result to keep their dreams alive at the top of the table? Tottenham are catching on their heels. Over the top for Hamza Rodriguez. Can he swing it in for the big Belgian? No, they can't. But it's played back to Fred. Pogba takes a strike. Oh, Pogba just getting his laces over it. That was a good chance for Manchester United. Fred pushing the ball into the uh, legs of Pogba. Pogba just striking it over the bar. Lukaku, oh, Williams getting in there for Dipota, pushing on, pushing it through, oh, pushing it over, pass back to the keeper, and uh, Haye with a nice easy catch, shame about the throw there, you expect better from the man between the sticks for Manchester United, Aaron Moy, Get it out. Was very there we go. Well played over for Rodriguez. What can he do? Oh, that was a very speculative effort there from Rodriguez. There we go. Half time, it's nil nil at home breaks. against Huddersfield. This isn't the result that Manchester United and their manager, Mr. P, is looking for. Manchester United with the two shots. None of them have been on target. They will be. There they are. The boys have come back out. Mr. P has been talking in Manchester United's ear about their possession. They need to be putting them chances away. Rodriguez with his selfish play in the first half. Taking that strike, he needs to be playing better opportunities for his teammates. Oh, and Martial. The French international, Martial. Showing so much promise for Manchester United. Wild effort there from him. Bailly with a good header there. Pogba playing it in. Martial had a shot. Good strike there. Unlucky. Martial pushing the full ball through. Pogba playing it in. Nice simple passes, Martial final pass, Rodriguez with a very close effort there for Manchester United. The threat at the moment isn't there. It's a good run down the right. Valencia pushing forward. 
Oh, and unlucky, the defender just doing that little flick, I think, put Martial off. It's getting late in the game. Huddersfield, they will, ta they will take this draw. He spotted the run and played Huddersfield it going to Manchester United with Old Trafford, getting a point. Deep They're cross. definitely taking that. Last flame members skill. of the game. Just Captain over Green. there by the Huddersfield oh, man. The Very play, pressuring down that left hand defending. side. They've got to stop the cross. Nicely placed, just waited. Past the Man United man. Header in just over. Could have been a different situation if he had. I've got that on target. I see that Mata Manchester is coming on for James now. now with, uh, a break in play. Well, Rodriguez just looking a bit too That's leggy. Oh, and, and there we go, the Old Trafford. Well, it nil -nil the home the fans are disgusted with Manchester United's form in this it's game. They were just snapping at chances, me, just weren't able to put them away. A lot stronger. I think You'd expect the more would just come to them, from Manchester United. And well, at home, you, you expect a lot better. Goodbye. Six shots, one on target. Huddersfield, one shot, and it wasn't on target. Manchester United fans will feel that they have been hard done by in this game. Huddersfield will take that draw. Matic has been selected as man of the match for the game against Huddersfield. Very unlucky for Man U there. So here we go. Here's a look at the day results. There is Man City beat Wolves 4-2, Huddersfield Town and Manchester United draw, Everton and Fulham was a 2-2 draw, Tottenham Hotspurs and Newcastle United was a 1-1 draw, very good result there for Newcastle United, and um, Crystal Palace beat Cardiff 2-0, Chelsea beat Bournemouth 4-0, Liverpool beat West Ham United 3-0, Leicester beat Burnley by 4-2, Watford beat Brighton by four goals to one. Arsenal beat Southampton two goals to none. So, Manchester United and Tottenham both tied for first place. Both got draws. So, what does that do with the league? That puts Manchester City at the top of the table on 14 points. Not what we're wanting to see there. Because Tottenham actually got their goal in that draw. That does put them above us in the table. We are now down to sixth. It is getting that close near the top now. Man City 14 points. Chelsea, Watford and Arsenal all on 13. Tottenham and Manchester United on 12. Whew. It's getting very, very tight. So here we go, Martial is improving dramatically at the moment. It's nice to see. Shaw's overall has increased to 79. Smalling has decreased to 80. Jones has mastered the Malaysia. I believe it's the Malaysia, I think. So here we are, Manchester United taking on Birmingham. Okay. Uh, let's have a look at the negotiations. I did offer Grant um, a new one-year deal. It's nice just to have him around as a, a backup. Because as, as you've seen lately, with a hell of that Romero let in, he's not going in between the sticks any time soon. And Joel Pereira is out on loan. So, let's have a quick look at what the mission is now. FA Cup, no missteps. You get me? The mark of a true champion is the ability to perform under pressure. Do me proud. I'll try. So here we go against Birmingham in the FA Cup. It's uh, definitely a different team that the manager has picked out there. Let's get straight into it. We are at Anfield hosting Birmingham for the FA Cup 
The manager for Manchester United has made changes in this game. The lineup has put in a couple of players from the bench, the likes of McTominay, Rashford, Lingard. With Grant in goal. Can the boys do it? Martial do with this. He swings one in for Mata. And Mata just not getting enough contact on it there. McTominay with a power strike. Truman, easy save. And I wish the underdogs the very best. There we go. Ashley Young to swing one in. And the keeper just making the effort to get the ball out. The manager will be looking for all these players to put in a very good shift. Seeing as uh, they had a draw in the Premier League. Wow, the defence just fell asleep there. What was the Manchester United back line doing? An easy goal there for Vassell for Birmingham. No one pressuring him. The Manchester United back line fast asleep. Look at this. He had a chance off the bar. Ball rolls back to Vassell's feet. Straight in the net. Grant didn't stand a chance. Defence not helping him out. There's 1 0 to Birmingham. They definitely deserved it. Straight out the gates. I think Manchester United have taken Birmingham far too lightly here. Fellaini with a soft as cheese challenge on the Birmingham man. Uh, that's a pretty harsh call there on Fellaini. They need to be creating space, making options. It's, they can't be taking him too lightly. And that's another easy chance there for Birmingham. Adams, their number nine. Just breaking through with a brilliant pass there. The defence again. Manchester United are just not taking this game seriously. And they need to. That was very disappointing there. Manchester United are not looking like themselves right now. Chris Smalling is way out of position. He'll be doing a lot better. They are 2-0 down now. Players' heads are not in this game. So as they go in at half-time, 2-0 down to Birmingham. What is going on with Manchester United? We're going to find out soon enough. They've had two shots, on tar two shots and one on target. The Birmingham's four shots, two on target. Man, you have had the possession. They're just not making it count. So here they are, Manchester United are coming out at the half time. They all look like they've had a stern talking to by Mr. P. They've obviously been told that they need to pull their finger out in the second half. There we go. The ball played nicely down to Valencia on the right wing. Oh, what a dive there. Oh, can Manchester United break? And there's no one in the area. Martial, lucky there. Here we go, McTominay. Oh, straight at the keeper there by McTominay all day. And look at this. What is the Manchester United man thinking? He's away. Grant's got to come out. Grant had to come out there. Manchester United defence. That is a disgusting decision there by the referee. Grant has been given the red card. Couldn't really see anything from that angle. Well, you can so, blame some suspect defensive that positioning for that set of circumstances, and they were just left. Is no very choice. poor there. We do have David De Gea on the bench. Grant had to come out and make the slide, but I think a red card was uh, a too harsh a decision He's there. Direct. In for the follow-up. to win it back. Manchester United really need to it's do something rushed. now. Lingard off the post there by Lingard 
they have no way now of coming back into this game and there we go Manchester United defence fast asleep 3-0 to Birmingham Adams with his second goal Manchester United in no man's land did Mr. P take this game not serious enough but look is on the side of Birmingham the lucky ricochets that have gone Birmingham's way that's it. That they is a very out. poor game Manchester for Manchester United. The the they got hammered 3 0 by Birmingham in the, the FA Cup first Jim. round. A exit from their very point, disgusting performance from taken. Manchester United. Sad and, and they had four shots, two on target to Birmingham's eight shots, five on target. Manchester United were just took to the cleaners. The ratings of every single player, Mata with a 4.5, Lingard with a 4.5, you got Young on a 4.5, the players just did not show up, and uh, G Adams there for Birmingham, got man of the match with 7.5, absolutely brilliant performance from them, they never gave up and they deserved the win, so here we go, Birmingham beat Manchester United on a 3-0, Stoke beat Bournemouth 1-0, Fulham beat Swansea by three goals to one, Leeds United beat Everton 1-0, shocking result there, uh, Tottenham Hotspurs beat Derby County 4-2, Watford beat Cardiff 2-0 in extra time, Brighton beat West Brom 1-0, Man City beat QPR 3-0, uh, Arsenal beat Norwich 3-1, Wolves beat Burnley 1-0, Huddersfield Town beat Leicester 3-0, West Ham beat Preston 1-0, Liverpool only just being able to beat Millwall 1-0. Aston Villa versus Crystal Palace ended in a 4-4 draw, but Aston Villa go through on penalties 6-5. Newcastle v Southampton was a 1-0. Chelsea v Sheffield Wednesday was a 4-1 thrashing. The only one of the big teams that did not go through was Manchester United getting hammered by Birmingham. The manager definitely took them far too lightly. So... Manchester United out of the FA Cup in the first round. That was definitely not expected. The players want to hang their head in shame. That is an absolutely disgusting display from the boys, especially against lower opposition. Very, very bad. And the owners trust now. There goes the FA Cup trophy to another team. You are going to apologise to the fans, or should I? I think the players that were on the pitch should all apologise to the fans. The form and what they did during that match was absolutely horrendous. And they need to own up to that. They need to pull their fingers out. So here we go again in the Champions League against Slava Pra. Let's get straight into kickoff with a full strength lineup by the looks of it the manager has chosen. So here we are at Old Trafford welcoming Slava Pra. Can Manchester United come back from that disgraceful effort in the previous game? They need to pull it out of the bag in this Champions League game if they want to get out of this group stage. They're going to have to put in a brilliant performance in this match. So here we are with the lineup. What a big, big lineup this is for Manchester United. They're not taking this game lightly. We can definitely see that. And what is the other opposition's team? And the wider like they are going to be very five, hard to get past in midfield. When it does turn Hopefully five, Manchester United's field. midfield the and attack can break them down. Full play through. Can Rodriguez keep it in? Yes, he does. Manchester, Valencia choosing to swing one in for so Man United. To get on to. Oh, and it was just too soft there for Martial. Ashley Young. Ashley Young swinging Ashley one in for the big Belgian. Unlucky there. 
and Pogba just back. unable. Martial, ah, and there we go, Martial out of swing, one in for the big Belgian. Oh, unlucky there for Manchester United. Need to be pressuring. Shots on. It's Lukaku. Lukaku with a good effort. Just unlucky. Swung back in by Valencia. And Lukaku. Oh, just headering it down and past the post. The big Belgian with a couple of great chances there. Valencia gets the ball back, swings one in. Lukaku with a very powerful effort, just aimed down to the floor. Nil-nil. Slava Prague are oh, doing well to hold their own against a strong Manchester United team. They've had three attempts, two on target. So here we are, the second half of this Champions League game. Manchester United looking Manchester refreshed. Lukaku with an effort and off the bar. What a strike. You expect a powerful effort from the man with the big physicality up top for Man U. Power strike on the left foot. Just cannons off of the bar. Something this chance. Rodriguez is coming off. Mata is being brought on. Oh, very good strike there from Fred. Manchester United making the intent. Good ball pushed through. Fred passes back. Pogba. Oh, Martial, sorry. Into Fred again with the nicest of strikes. And there it is. Manchester United again. Very, very sluggish in this game. They just are not able to put that ball in the back of the net. They have seven chances, three on target. Slava Prague not making any shots, but still managed to come away against Manchester United in the Champions League with a good nil-nil draw. And the man of the match was Manchester United's Fred with a 6.5 rating. The team really didn't play too bad, it's just they couldn't finish their chances. And so here we are with the other results of the group stages. We have Atletico Madrid beating AEK Athens by four goals to one. Monaco beating Club Bruges one nil. Manchester United and Slava Prague nil nil. Good result for Prague, gives them in there. Benfica beating PSG by one goal to nil. Man City beating Bromby by three goals to nil. Juventus beating Sporting CP by four goals to one. Tottenham Hotspur is beating your boys 1-0. Ajax and Shakhtar Donetsk was a 1-1 draw. Liverpool beat FCSB by three goals to one. Real Madrid beat Anderlecht by one goal to nil. Inter Milan beat Chardonnay by four goals to one. Shak Schalke beat Celtic by one goal to nil. Roma beat Malmo two goals to nil. And Lokomotiv Moscow beat Galatasaray 1-0. Barcelona hammered Midland by three goals to one. Porto beat Lyon 1-0. And very good results there. Shame about luckily, after those three games, Manchester United luckily are still in second place in Group B. With the way Manchester United's form has been of late, you know, is Mr P looking to make drastic changes I guess you'll have to find out in the next episode Manchester United need to start pulling in some decent form till then don't forget to hit the like button hit that subscribe button it definitely helps the channel and also if you want to be notified of any new videos that come out on this channel don't forget to hit that notifications bell icon that note I will see you in the next episode